The other knot I use most besides the Palomar knot is the Improved Clinch Knot. Improved Clinch Knots are great. They have a high breaking strength, but when you use them, a lot of times when you're using longer baits and you don't want to create a big loop end on the Palomar knot, or when I'm using a Carolina rig or tying to a swivel on the upline side. To tie an Improved Clinch Knot, it's basically you're going to take your line, go through the eye of the hook, and what you're going to do is go back through the same way you went through the first time. What that's going to do is create a loop. So you're going to see here I've got a little loop set up. What you do with your tag end is you basically run it around your main line seven times or six times, whatever you prefer. A lot of times I'll do six with the heavier line and I'll do seven with a lighter line. Your tag end then is going to be put through the two loops that are together and you see them right there. There's the loop that I created and the loop due to the twisting. You take that through there and what I like to do is just slightly pull down on both at the same time. When you get to a certain point, you're not going to want to snug that up because you need to wet it. A little bit of lubrication on the thing and when you slide it down, you can cinch that right up. Now this knot is great for keeping your bait straight, it's great for tying on big lures and it's great for tying anytime you're tying on an upline side and you can't do a Palomar knot. That's the improved clinch knot and it's the second most popular knot that I use on a daily basis. Mm -hmm.